either rain or snow, only four completely dry weekends, and this is shaping up to be a wet one for us, but first we're going to deal with some cold air. We'll find it colder for tomorrow, the high of 35, then on Saturday, a morning low of 15 and a high of only 25 degrees, so that's 24 degrees below average, but we get above the norm with temperatures back in the 50s on Sunday and Monday. CBS 4 Future View shows a leading edge of the snow making its way to northwest Indiana by midnight. The snow showers stay across west central Indiana on through 2 a.m and everything stays north of Interstate 70 on through 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. We'll find the low temperature 28 in Lafayette tonight, 31 in Columbus, and 32 for the low temperature here in the state capital. Tomorrow morning, snow showers are likely from Peru to Lafayette on down through Crawfordsville into Lebanon. We'll keep the snow showers north of Interstate 70 in the morning, but everything moves south late tomorrow afternoon, so snow showers are likely over the southern part of the state. High temperatures are going to get just above freezing in Lafayette and Kokomo, as warm as 38 here in the city and in Columbus, forecasting a high of 39 in Bloomington. More snow showers are likely for us tomorrow evening across central Indiana. Right on through your Saturday morning, we'll keep clouds and a few flurries around. And by the time the snow winds down, we'll see an inch, maybe a couple spots as much as two inches of snow with a heavy accumulation south of Interstate 70. Overnight, cloudy and colder. Light snow is likely to a northwest after midnight, down to 32. And for your day tomorrow, cloudy, colder, snow spreading southward with a high at 38. And our seven day forecast, a cold snap comes in on Saturday with a high at 25. We'll go to daylight saving time on Sunday with sunny skies and warmer weather with a high at 52. In the 50s with a chance of rain coming up on Monday, 50s on Tuesday, 60s on Wednesday. And by St. Patrick's Day, we'll enjoy sunny skies on Thursday with a high at 70. All right, Chris.